Why are fans targeting artists on stage? Why do music fans throw projectiles on stage while their favorite artist performs? Nicholas Malvagna, a 27-year-old from New Jersey, offered one explanation after he was charged with assault for throwing a phone at the pop singer Bibi Rexa, who required stitches after being hit. Malvagna apparently thought it would be funny to whack Rexa, who later posted a photo of her bruised and bandaged eyebrow. In good, Rexa captioned the Instagram post, though some fans noted online that if the phone had landed just a little further down, it could have caused serious harm to her eye. The projectile called to mind recent face-offs between celebrities and tossed items. Last year, the singer Steve Lacey smashed an iPhone that had been launched on stage by a fan. A few months before that, a Toronto audience member hurled a doll at Lady Gaga as she sang the theme song to Top Gun, Maverick. Ever the professional, Gaga did not miss a beat and continued her performance. The same week as the Rexa incident, a fan stormed the Los Angeles stage where Ava Max performed, slapping the singer so hard that he scratched the inside of her eye, according to her tweet. Artists have long dodged stray objects thrown by fans. Tom Jones made tossed underwear part of his act for decades, the Beatles were pelted by jelly beans, and David Bowie was nailed by a lollipop at a Norway show. But fans say there's a reason these instances seem to be happening more often. Celebrities like Doja Cat, Olivia Rodrigo, and Billie Eilish have taken fans' phones, consensually, filmed the video mid-show, and given the phones back to their owners. It's a way to go viral, so impatient fans are flinging their iPhones in hopes that their favorite singer will leave them a little gift. Paul Wertheimer, a crowd safety manager, also blames the apparent increase on people getting out their post-lockdown aggression. We all said that crowds would be more rambunctious, disorderly, and energetic after people came out of being cooped up, Wertheimer said. When crowds get rowdy, people can feel anonymous, and that leads them to doing antisocial, dangerous things. Fans are not the only people who throw things into crowds, singers themselves do it, too. Beyonce tossed sunglasses into the crowd during a recent UK show on her Renaissance tour. In March, Chris Brown invited a fan on stage for a lap dance, only to grab her phone and hurl it into the crowd because he was annoyed with her constant filming. Last year, Axl Rose said he would stop his decades-long tradition of throwing his mic into the crowd after an Australian woman suffered a black eye and busted nose when it hit her in the face.